Live from coast to coast and around the world, it's time for the Saturday Night Knife and Gun Show. If you can shoot it or sharpen it, you'll find it right here at great prices. Now, here's your host, Mike Politowski. Well, hello America. Welcome to another exciting edition of the Saturday Night Knife and Gun Show. I am Mike Politowski, the round man with the square deal here on another beautiful Saturday evening coming to you live from the great state of North Carolina. We are located in Asheboro, North Carolina, which is in the geographic center of the state. Welcome to our broadcast on Facebook Live and also we're broadcasting live tonight on Roku. If you don't have a Roku, you need to get one because that is the way it is all headed. That is the way it is all headed. Even major satellite providers are predicting that Roku is the wave of the future and we're already on that wave riding it high and mighty with the Knife and Gun Show. So if you get a Roku, do a search for the Knife and Gun Show channel and you will find us. Well, like and share this broadcast. It could mean great things for you this evening. You know, uh, I did some research this week and I got to thinking. I, I looked at our very first show that we did back in September of 2016 and it was very successful. We had 7,000, nearly 8,000 views on that show. And I said, what is the difference between that show and what we're doing now? And if you were with me back then when we started the Saturday Night Knife and Gun Show back up on Facebook Live, you will remember that that show we gave everything away. We said, we're going to give it all away. All you have to do is like and share the broadcast and we'll put your name in the hopper randomly choose winners for the prizes that we demonstrated on TV and it was wildly successful. It was a great show. So I thought, well, you know, we should try that again. And you know what? I think we are going to do that again tonight. So go ahead and tell your friends about this and like and share this broadcast right now on Facebook. And we want our Roku viewers to also be able to get in on the action as well. If you can go to our website, we do have a contact button at the knifeandgunshow.com website. There is a contact button there that uh, you, could, you can email us. It will automatically send an email to us. Or if you want to manually send an email, you can do that. Mike at knifeandgunshow.com or info at knifeandgunshow.com. And we'll throw all of those in a pile as well, and we'll choose some winners from that as well. So the winners will be chosen at random, and uh, the prizes that you get will be chosen at random. It doesn't matter if you spent a dollar with me in the past or a thousand dollars with me in the past. That doesn't have any bearing on this at all. Uh, we're going to try to be very fair about it. We let a computer pick the prizes. We let a computer pick the winners, and then we mail that to you. We notify you by Facebook Messenger, or if you've emailed us, we'll notify you by email and let you know that you've won a prize and then we'll request your address information. Uh, I'm going to do something a little bit different. Back in September, we didn't put a time frame on when you could claim your prizes. So uh, believe it or not, we still have people who are claiming prizes all the way back from the very first show we did in September. And that's not a problem. I, I don't mean to say it like that. We did go ahead and send them their free prizes. That's not an issue at all. It's just we'll put probably a, a 10 day a 10 day limit on it or some, something to that effect, say that this offer is good until uh, such and such date, just, just to be, you know, I mean, probably when I'm 90 years old, I'll probably get an email saying, you know, 35 years ago, I, I got a free gift from you and when you get a chance, send it. So what we'll do is we'll put a little time limit on it just that way. Those, those will be going out to people who stay current with what we do here at the Knife and Gun Show. So we're going to do that tonight. I have a, a wide range of merchandise that we're going to be featuring. Well, I'm a little short staffed this evening. My son, uh, Michael, who normally does uh, camera work for me, is in Washington, D.C. on a Civil Air Patrol uh, mission tonight. Actually, uh, his whole squadron is out. Uh, they've been to the Aviation Museum. They've been uh, to the National Archives. Uh, uh, I think they're looking for Obama's birth certificate up there. Maybe they'll find that. But anyway, they're over there doing that and uh, staying at a hotel and having a good time. They've been gone a couple of days, should be back tomorrow. Uh, Jimmy Browse, who normally runs the 747, is out of town also tonight with his lovely bride. Giovanna and Carrie is here tonight helping me run the 747. So what we've done 
a uh, little behind the scenes information. We just took our, uh, our, our studio camera over here and we nailed it down. So there, the close up shots may be uh, missing tonight, but we have a camera that's, that's kind of nailed down right here to the center of my desk. So Carrie and I are pretty sharp. We got this thing figured out. Uh, we're gonna have a show. And as I said tonight, everything that we show will uh, be giving away. Some things we have one of, some things we have many of. And uh, again, the, the winners will be chosen at random and the, the prizes will be chosen at random as well. And then we'll notify you by Facebook Messenger or email for your address so that we can send those out to you. So that's, it's gonna be fun. We're hoping to, to uh, have a lot of folks come in and view the program this evening. So right now, if you would, go ahead and hit the share button and the like button that enters you automatically on Facebook and you might want to share it and just say hey there's a guy that's gone crazy he's giving away things on TV it's the craziest shopping show you've ever seen he's giving it all away tonight so uh, good luck to you and hopefully you'll uh, score one of these cool prizes that we have here to feature tonight well it's been a great week uh, I mentioned last week that I accepted a position as general manager for a Christian TV station, Channel 21 in Charlotte, North Carolina. This was my first full week of, uh, of managing that station, driving from Asheboro to Charlotte. It's about an 80 mile drive one way. So we spent a lot of time on the highway getting there, but I tell you what, the uh, blessings are already evident in our relationships over there and it's going to be fantastic. So I just wanna say thank you to those of you who have kept us in your prayers uh, and I, I want you to know that prayer works tonight we've even got a faith-based product that deals with the power of prayer and I'll be showing you that here shortly one thing uh, it's, it wasn't funny when it happened but it's kind of funny now if you look at my left eye this eye right here it kind of looks like I've been in a fight uh, Letty did not hit me with any kind of uh, uh, candlestick or baseball bat or anything like that. On my first day uh, at, at my job site in Charlotte, I was walking up to my office building and I'm like, wow, would you look at this office building? And I'm walking and it's raining, right? And I'm just like, oh Lord, thank you so much. This is just, this is awesome. And I was looking at that big building. The next thing I knew, I was looking at the concrete sidewalk. Uh, there was a little place on the sidewalk that had raised up and my right foot hit that and I went traveling. And I mean, I fell face first. That's the first time in my life that I have fell flat on my face. My arms, I didn't have my arms out, fell flat on my face. And um, I, I looked, uh, Carrie said it looked like a drag queen and I don't know what that is. I don't have anything to, I'm really not into auto racing or anything like that. So uh, she said something about a queen or something in the way, and I had some makeup on us, what it looked like. But, and then I, I, I busted my lip, uh, and I was, I was spitting blood. So you can imagine when I go in to meet people, I'm like, uh, they're, they're like, uh, who's this? And uh, hey, I'm the new guy. I'm the new man on the block here at Channel 21. Uh, then Letty and I, the next day, we began watching some YouTube commercials about Tariton cigarettes. Does anybody out there remember Tariton cigarettes? The, where that was the ad campaign that said, I would rather fight than switch, and, and the folks had the black eye. Well, I have not taken up Tariton cigarettes. I just have a black eye. So if you're seeing me tonight, you're saying, what happened to his eye? Well, that's what happened to my eye. If you could even see it. Can you see it, Carrie? Can you see it? It just looks really dark. Yeah. Boy, you should have seen it a couple of days ago. It was really dark. All right, Carrie, what else do I have in there? Let's take, let's talk about Roku. Uh, yesterday at my office in Charlotte, I installed one of these right here. It's called the Roku Express. Now, th these are $29.99 and they have an HDMI cable with them that allows you to connect it to any HD television. And so they give you the cable, they give you the little power supply, they give you the converter box and the remote control and the batteries. All that for $29. I bought mine at Walmart. Now I bought what was called a Roku Express Plus. 
the plus had an additional cable in it you, you know those cables that have the uh, the white red and yellow connector that you can plug into an older TV I went ahead and, and bought the plus model I do have an HD TV obviously in my office in Charlotte uh, so I use the HDMI cable but if I ever want to hook that up to an older TV I can do that so so here it is. We're on Roku. We're broadcasting live right now on Roku. You'll you'll really enjoy our channel, and you can get to it by getting one of these. This is uh, this is the lowest price Roku that I'm aware of, and it has all the current features of, of some of the more expensive ones. Uh, it will play the Knife and Gun Show absolutely uh, beautifully, and you can get Netflix, you can get Hulu, and you can get Amazon those kind of things on there as well those are those are pay services the knife and gun show channel is absolutely free to you and there's about a thousand channels on there that are you know absolutely free so 15 million people have this right near 5,000 of those people have made the knife and gun show one of their favorites and i just appreciate you for tuning in tonight let us know if you're watching on roku send me an email at mike at knife and gun show dot com and and let us know how things are going. Give us some feedback on that. What we've heard so far is that it's uh, it's working very well for us. And there's there's good things coming to Roku. If you go to my website at knifeandgunshow.com, this is what the web page looks like. Uh, we are starting on our Roku channel the first televised knife and gun show in America. Basically, it allows you to start your own home shopping show on the knife and gun show you get these five minute segments that you can you can uh, uh, put what you have for sale and it allows you to make some money as as well uh, we don't charge any commission off of your sales in fact the customers will have your contact information right at their fingertips they'll be able to contact you directly it doesn't matter what is on there for sale as long as it's legal and anything that's typically displayed at a gun or a knife show is fair game you can put that on here we do allow firearms on there we allow pocket knives obviously hunting knives custom made knives uh, jewelry th things like that things coins and, and uh, pocket watches things you would normally see at a gun show a walk-in gun show and there are thousands of people that are going to be able to browse through these little five-minute videos. And if they see something they like, they'll call you directly and deal with you directly over the phone or over email with it. Yeah, very interesting concept. We're, we're really just now getting into the promotion phase of this and getting ready to, uh, to kick it off and, and, and really push it forward in a higher volume. So we're trying to get a good subscriber base built up here with the Roku box so that people will be able to see but we are interested in having you on there. Uh, you can change the video a couple of times a month. It's real easy. You just do it with your smartphone. You just do a little five-minute video, and yes, then you'll be on TV, national TV. So there you go, knifeandgunshow.com. Also, there is a button. That's all right. No, it's, there's a button on the left side of that that uh, says buy show products here. It's a little purple purple button that you can click on that and if you see something on TV or if you want to see what we have featured on TV you can click on that and uh, if it's for sale you'll find it right there on our website. I want to say thank you to people. There are people out there who are very generous. They've donated to our show. As you know the program here is brought to you by Spiritual First Responders. We are a ministry and we do this kind of as a ministry outreach to help fund what we do with our, our, our ministry. So basically a spiritual first responder is a person that uh, goes out and uh, meets the needs of people who are struggling spiritually with a spiritual emergency. Now spiritual emergency can be anything from uh, sickness or it could be uh, they, they, may need, they may need some financial help here and there, those kind of things. We try to connect people with resources. We obviously we pray for folks who are uh, ill or who are infirmed and if that's you and if you are in need of prayer, I, I want you to uh, either call me or you can uh, send an email as well and we'll get back with you and we'll pray for you. And you know what, we've seen some amazing miracles. We do the knife and gun show that help offset some of the expenses. We have a fairly large building here in Asheboro, North Carolina. And of course, all of our utilities and electricity and, and uh, gas and water and rent, all those, all those obligations have to be met and this little show helps offset some of those expenses. So again, spiritual first responders, keep us in your prayers. And if, if you need prayer, obviously we will be able to be there for you 
if that's the case. Speaking of prayer, we're going to start off with a faith-based product since this is a faith-based show. This is one of our giveaways here. Uh, this is a necklace and it says prayer power on it right here. So this may be one of the free items that you receive in the mail absolutely free. Again, we're going to uh, ask you to like and share the broadcast right now. And yes, we do have some pocket knives that we're going to give away as well, and I'll be showing some of those momentarily, but I just want to start it off with this prayer power. Carrie and I were having a discussion about prayer uh, on the way to the studio this evening, and did you know that uh, long prayers, long drawn-out prayers do not impress God. In fact, if you go to the good book, Matthew 6 and verse 5, it says, don't pray like the publicans pray. It didn't say republicans, it said publicans uh, with the long, uh, drawn out, flowery, fancy prayers trying to impress people. That's not what gets God's attention. So uh, you might want to go read that and check it out. Just keep it simple. It's, and you know what I do? Can I just share a little bit about my prayer life with you? Over the past few years, I've come to realize that the good Lord uh, has provided every good and perfect thing that we need. He's already given it to us. He's already made it available to us. Right now, in my opinion, God is resting. God's not up there at a big table uh, rubber stamping whether or not you should get healed or uh, or looking through your files and seeing, uh, seeing if you've been a good person. Uh, I, I don't believe that. I believe that. When those of you who are believers, when he sees you, he sees Jesus Christ in you. That's what he sees. So prayer life, faith is what makes faith is what makes prayer work. Put me on TV, Carrie. I, I, I just got I got to say this because it's so real. And, it, and those of you who are struggling with something in your life right now, if you uh, if you have a desire for something, uh, the good book says that everything with God is yes and amen. He's not going to give you anything that's going to harm you. Now, he gives you free choice where you can go make those decisions if you want, but he's he, everything is yes and amen. No good thing will he withhold from you. So start declaring. Change your prayer life into uh, a declaration, a declaration of faith. Say, Lord, I thank you for a good job. I thank you for my health. I thank you that cancer cannot survive in my body. I thank you that I'm healed. Those are declarations. Those, those are things. The Bible says, let the weak say that I am strong. The Bible doesn't ask you to lie. Uh, so God would never ask you to lie. In the Ten Commandments, He says, thou shalt not lie. But yet it says, let the weak say that I am strong. Now, why would He say that? He's saying that because you are the one in charge of declaring your future. Does that make sense? So say to God, I thank you that I'm well. I thank you that every need that I have is being met. And turn your prayer life into a praise, not, not a time that you uh, say, uh, gimme, gimme, this is Jimmy. The, the Lord doesn't respond to that. I really don't believe he responds to that. I believe he responds to you believing that you are going to have that which you ask for. And that's in Mark 11, 23. So Jesus says, only believe. Now, you can believe the report of the enemy, which might be telling you that you're sick and that you're going to die. You can believe that. And if you believe that, you give life to the lie. The lie is that God wants you well. The lie is God wants you prosperous. Well, how did I get down this rabbit trail tonight? I don't know, but I, you know, I feel like that I'm saying something for somebody out there specifically. And if I'm talking to you, then you may be the only person I'm, I'm sharing this for, and that's okay. We'll take time out just for you. Just declare, just believe. Don't believe the lies of the enemy. Believe what Jesus Christ says about you. By his stripes, you're already healed. That uh, Jesus became poor so that you may become rich. Uh, that, that's, those are declarations. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. Those are good things. Those are good things. So put that into, into your prayer life, okay? So we're giving away prayer power necklaces. That's one of the things. All right, let's, let's move on. All right, I thought it would be a pretty cool idea to give away a couple of different lighters. And I have two different styles here, and I'll, I'll, we'll show these right here. These are, these are not Zippo, but they are Zippo 
type lighters. When I say Zippo, everybody understands that that is a, an oil-based lighter that you, you put lighter fluid in. This one is, is pretty neat. It has, I'm not sure what this is, but this is some sort of semi-precious stones on, uh, on the, the front of this lighter. Very nice. So if we draw your name randomly and it matches up with one of these randomly, you'll be getting one of these in the mail. So that's style number one. Here is style number two. This one comes in a little collectible tin. And this one has some pretty fancy engraving on it. I hope that's coming through on your television this evening. Uh, it's a little, uh, just a, a, a CNC machined uh, casing on it here, which really catches a light and reflects it well. Uh, most people will probably never use these. Uh, you, you may, you may, but uh, probably folks just kind of put these up because they're pretty. It's one of those pretty things. We're giving away a, a pretty lighter tonight. There are a lot of lighter collectors out there that watch this show, and I appreciate you watching this show. Some of the things we show tonight will be available on the website. These probably not available on the website, but we're going to be giving some of these away. All right, put me on TV, Carrie. I've got more great things to, to show you here. I'm excited about this. The, again, if you're just now joining me, we're trying to get the number of viewers up, and I'd like for you to like and share this broadcast right now if you're watching me on Facebook or if you're watching me on Roku. Sometime during the week, I'd like for you to go to the KnifeAndGunShow.com website and click on the contact button and just put in there hey watching the show hopefully i'll win uh, something free and then we'll what we'll do is we'll draw randomly from those people who've liked and shared the broadcast and we'll also draw randomly from those who contact us by email that are watching by roku and we'll select random winners and random prizes and we will notify you and there'll be about a 10 day window there for you to to give me your address so that we can mail that to you now we'll draw next saturday so not today or not tonight or tomorrow, but we'll draw next Saturday. That way the broadcast has all week long uh, to play and so folks can get entered. And we want as many people as possible to know about what we do here on the Saturday Night Knife and Gun Show every Saturday night. So if you would uh, like and share the broadcast, it's just that simple. And hopefully, hopefully you will be a winner. Well, I found a pretty cool product this week. Uh, it's simple, but it, it's pretty neat. This runs on three triple a batteries and it is uh it has a piece of adhesive on the back of it and if you have an unlit closet in your home that you need some light in this is basically a light switch and it comes in different colors so the colors may vary if you win one of these you might get a red one you might get a green one you carry what they had orange do they have orange and blue okay so but basically it's got six led lights in it and when you turn it on and i'm hoping this comes through good on your tv this evening it really is very bright now we have some extremely bright lights in here uh, so uh, if you get one of these in the mail that's going to be awesome it's uh, just a little portable light switch and night light you could use it as a night light I don't know how long the batteries uh, will last in this, but you can replace the batteries, and we do include the batteries with it. So it's just like a wall switch. Turn it off and on. And um, so that's, that's another one of our, our... We try to select some free gifts here tonight that are unique uh, and something that may be of use to you. And some, some of the things we have here are just, well, they're just fun. All right, put me back on TV. Let's do a knife. I've, I've got... Uh, uh, pocket knife here by Tool Choice. This is a Victorinox styled knife like the uh, what you'd call the uh, Army, uh, what do they call Swiss Army, yeah, Swiss Army, yeah. Swiss Army, Swiss Army type knife. It's not, obviously it's not Victorinox, but it's, this is made by a company called Tool Choice. There's three blades on here. One is a file, one is a little pin blade, and then you have a nice little pair of scissors. This also, yes, it does also have the the toothpick in it and then on the reverse side it does have tweezers as well so this might be one of your gifts that you get here as well now uh, the traditional red maroon red uh, acrylic handles is the handle material on that so again uh, that will fit right in your watch pocket it does have the little uh, lanyard eyelet here that you can use to put it on your keychain so there you go, little gentleman's knife there we've got going, going on as well. 
Uh, let's do this. Carrot, let's do the laser now. What do you say? Look at this. This is neat. Now, now this will be on the website if you want to purchase one of these. Yeah, so, so this, this is a laser, and it's actually quite powerful. It's, uh, it's a green laser pointer. It has about a one-mile range on this thing. I mean, it, it will absolutely light it up. This is not an inexpensive this is uh, not an inexpensive laser, but a quality laser, and also it, it comes with the AAA batteries as well, so those will be included with it. Push button operation, you can put it in your pocket uh, with a pocket clip, and I'm just going to say right now, do not, whatever you do, do not shine this up at any kind of an airplane because it is absolutely very, very bright. Uh, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just try to, to shine it here on on my table here and this has a, a a collimator lens on it that you can turn and and it puts a star pattern and maybe that's coming through I hope that's coming through good and also now this this will this little thing here will come off this little lens will come off and then you can get just your standard spot your green spot and boy is it ever bright I'm telling you, I hope, I, again, I hope this comes through good, but I mean to tell you what, this, ow, that is bright, that is bright. Now, I would shine it in the, in the camera, I don't know what I have if I shine that in the camera. Whoa, I better not do that. Anyway, green laser, don't run, run everybody off. Some people are watching this and probably got the lights turned out, and if I did that, that, though, That'd, that'd wake them right up, wouldn't it? But anyway, that's kind of, uh, you see, yeah, that's nice. So we're going to give one away, all right? Now, I will put these on the website. Uh, I've seen these for as much as 50 bucks. But what we're going to do, what we're going to do is we're going to put it on the website for uh, for $19.99. Okay, so if you want one, uh, I, got, I got a good deal on them, and uh, I'll pass that along to you. $19.99 on those. I'm excited about that. All right, so uh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. What are we going to do next, Carrie? Let's, all right, let's go ahead and get this out of the way. Here is a seven-piece manicure set. Colors may vary on this. All right, this is nice, though. I mean, it's got two different types of uh, a right-angle cutter and a regular fingernail uh, trimmer here, scissors, uh, files, cuticle. The ladies know what this is, right? And guys, if you get one of these, don't tell me you ain't got no fingernails. I know better than that, but if, if you get one of these and, and you want to give it to your sweetie, she might give you a smooch or something for being so kind to her. And if if you get something here that uh, in the mail that you didn't particularly wish for, that's okay. I want you to pass it along, give it away to somebody else as well, all right? So now the colors will vary on this. It comes in a very nice carrying case. The colors will vary. We've seen them in red. We've seen them in purple. We've even seen some that look like those 1960 Volkswagen bus vans with the flowers all over them from the hippie days. But I thought I'd bring a purple one on TV here tonight because it looks pretty. All right, put me on TV. So again, giving them away. All right, now this was sent to us for evaluation. This is an Elk Ridge pocket knife here with imitation abalone handles. I have the original retail box for this. I'm gonna be giving this away to somebody. Again, like and share this broadcast right now on Facebook or at some point uh, during the week if you're watching this broadcast later. Uh, the following Saturday, uh, from tonight, we, we will choose the winners and we will notify you by Facebook Messenger or by email. If you want to email and let me know you're watching, say you're watching on Roku, then go to knifeandgunshow.com and click that contact button and there's a form that you can fill out and just put in there, hey, I'm watching you on Roku. And then we'll uh, put you in, in there for a random drawing as well. I appreciate all of my Roku viewers out there this is two and three quarters inches in the closed position imitation abalone handles stainless steel high polished stainless steel bolsters blades and liners not available on the website i've got this one and got the original factory box with it hopefully you can win that all right something really cool that i am really excited about and uh, i do believe i'm going to put these make these available on the website 
This is awesome. This is a die cast train set. And get it focused in here. A die cast train set officially licensed by guess who? Remington. It has the bullet engine, the tanker. It has the flat car with a truck, a Remington box truck on it, and it has the caboose. This is called the Floor Flyer Train Set. I have seen these on eBay for 25 bucks. This thing was made in 2005. It's very collectible. And yes, we're gonna give one of these away. Uh, but we will make these available on the website, and I'm thinking probably they'll be $14.99. So if you go to knifeandgunshow.com, you'll see the buy products here from the show button. You click on that, and if you want to purchase one of these, it's probably a pretty good investment. Again, officially a license to buy Remington. It's a train set, so it's got the engine, the tanker car, the flat car with the box truck on it and the caboose, all die cast, all very nice. Can't go wrong with officially licensed Remington product. All right, check it out. Okay, all right, so let's do another knife right quick. Here is a Rough Rider, five inches in the closed position, saw cut bone, large Texas toothpick. I've got fluted nickel silver bolsters on this one, a nice stainless steel blade, brass pins and liners, and saw cut bone on here. Now last week we showed a couple of, of knives with this saw cut bone pattern on it, and some of, some of that is still available if you wanna to go to the website and check that out. But uh, this one is out of box, so you're gonna get it just like this. We'll probably close it before we mail it to you, but this one's gonna be a freebie. Somebody is gonna score a nice Rough Rider large Texas toothpick, five inches again in the closed position. Good luck to you on that. Just like and share the broadcast. Tell all your friends about the Saturday Night Knife Gun Show because we have a good time here every Saturday night at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And getting ready for the last couple of things here to get out of here tonight. So again, uh, like and share the broadcast. Let your friends know. We've got some egg-shaped LED flashlights with a lanyard on them. And these are bright. They have six LEDs in them. Here's the little lanyard. There's a push button here. They do come with instructions. When you get it, you have to unscrew this. And there's a little protective piece of plastic in there that keeps it from turning on and the battery wearing out on it. But I'm just gonna put this on here and I wanna just tell you that this little critter is very bright. So a little egg-shaped uh, anodized aluminum uh, encasement on here. Very nice, again, six high quality LEDs that, that uh, you might get an egg shaped flashlight as your free gift. We have a few of these left, not just a whole bunch. And then I'll get out of here with this little bitty knife. This is a little Rough Rider knife. Now this is donated by my good buddy, Barry Anderson. Barry had sent us quite a few products and I appreciate his donation. We have other folks who are sending some items in. I'm gonna have a wide array of items to be featured on the show here pretty soon um, that are coming from Texas. And I, I'm, I'm just excited. I appreciate people stepping up to the plate and supporting what we do here. And it's time now to give back. I mean, God has been so good to me and so good to us here at the Knife and Gun Show. I said, let's just, let's just have some fun tonight and let's, let's give back. And I think that's an awesome thing. Three inches in the closed position green Appaloosa bone handles, 440A stainless steel blades, brass liners, and nickel silver bolsters and brass pins. Who's sharing the broadcast right now? Thank you so much for sharing and liking the broadcast here at the Saturday Night Knife and Gun Show. All right, so I'm gonna get out of here. We may do this again next week. I, You know, you can't beat generosity. That's one of the four Gs that my mom instilled in me when I was a kid. Is, uh, and, and you know what, I think, uh, I, I think that the good Lord puts us here not to be in what I call the toil system. The toil system is where you where you work, 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 and, and you just you know you just barely have enough to get by. I don't think that is the Lord's intention for our life. I think He wants to see us prosperous. I think He wants to see us have these resources funnel through us 
so that we in turn can turn around and bless people. So keep that in mind, will you? All right. Okay. I love you. I appreciate you for joining us here tonight. Uh, hello to everybody out there in the chat room that's on there right now. I appreciate you liking and sharing this broadcast. If you're watching this later, remember we do this live on Saturday nights at 7 p.m. on Facebook Live and also on Roku. Get a Roku because there's big things in store for that. We'd like to have you also selling product on Roku. You could send us an email and ask for more information on that. There's several of the questions about it answered on the website, some tutorial videos on how to get started. We'd love to hear from you. All right, God bless you. This is Big Mike saying, what's the use in living if you can't love? What's the use in loving if you can't love everyone? The good Lord above has all the answers. All you and I need to do is pray for the right questions. God bless you, America. I'll see you next week here on the Saturday Night Knife and Gun Show.